This is to show how easy it is to make some changes to your mass airflow curve using binary editor. So I know I have a, a few cells down low here that are running too rich because of some changes I made to my um, air filter setup in the vehicle. So to figure that out, um, the little drive, and uh, we have about a 60 second log here of just some light crews in those lower cells to get some data on how much how it's running too rich. So traditionally you'd find your mass airflow voltage, uh, move along to certain voltage points that, that correlate to your curve over here, find those points, um, see how many pounds of air you're supposed to have, and uh, work out your offset for you know commanded lambda and what you're actually getting and then do a conversion. Uh, it's so much easier with this you can open up a mapping tool and right here we have voltages that match a mass airflow curve and we have mass airflow voltage versus the actual pound minute and then we have something here called air fuel ratio error which is a feature of the core tuning strategies which is the error of how much your air fuel is off from the targeted lambda so it really doesn't matter if you go into wide open throttle because it's it's look looking at what the actual commanded lambda was so we can open up our file which is that log we were just looking at and there it is we've got the the average of how much it was too rich and excuse me take average you have last known min max and so forth so there's the average, and what you do then is go to your mass curve, and you can see here it's at 166, to just right there. So we'll go here and we just highlight it, copy, come over here, and simply paste percentage, and watch the numbers there, how they'll change as I click paste percentage. And that's it. You're done. You just changed all those cells, correctly calculated for commanded lambda, and by the offset of what error they were at.